Hydropower is the oldest and most reliable form of renewable energy. We're installing hydrokinetic turbine into the South Boulder Canal. We're putting the first unit in today. It's a real tight fit. <laughs> We got about three inches, three or four inches to spare. And we'll be placing 10 of these within about 1,200 feet of this overall nine mile long canal coming from Gross Dam. Essentially, as water flows through that box, it causes the twin turbines to turn and that activates a proprietary gearing and drive system that we have, generating 10 kilowatts of electric power. What we're gonna try and do is capture the kinetic energy of the water that we're sending from Gross uh, to Ralston. Today, the energy in that water is not utilized for anything. It's just a water conveyance. Energy provides a sustainable way for our customers to tap into slow or shallow waterways for renewable sources of electric power. Unlike alternatives like solar or wind turbines that only operate when the sun shines or when the wind blows, these turbines are designed to operate 24 hours a day, seven days a week. This is a bit of an untapped resource for hydropower. It amasses about um, 80 megawatt hours a year in continuous operation, which is the energy equivalence of about seven average U.S. homes. We see this as an emerging area for hydropower. And even though it's not huge megawatt numbers for hydropower, every kilowatt counts. It's like a glove. Now let's start generating some power. This research project is a collaboration between a number of entities public and private. This pilot will allow us to make better informed decisions as to how to use our energy. The National Renewable Energy Laboratory is involved and they're helping us with some of the electrical calculations, how we're going to tie into the grid. We also have the Bureau of Reclamation, a federal entity who is helping us with the water data and logging flows and things like that. We also have Colorado School of Mines and they have some senior students who are working in two different teams on projects to help us analyze the, the data. I've spent the last two and a half, three years on designing those rotors. Probably one of the proudest moments of my life. We have a responsibility to the environment and this is part of a portfolio of renewable energy that Denver Water is involved with. We, we already have hydropower at quite a few of our dam sites and we're looking to the future to be able to expand our hydroelectric capabilities and, and this is really the, the forefront of, of that effort. It's a game changer. This is really proving a concept that can be replicated not just here in the United States throughout thousands of miles of canals but also across the world.